how my failures turned into lessons, but I still stayed motivated. My life has taught me a lot through my failures. I always thought that if you didn't hit your goals that you failed, but that's not the case. Your life has to mold you into a new person through adversity. Success when I was a teenager was lots of money, lots of friends, the new sneaker coming out. Growing up now, I look at success differently. Now, I know that success is giving an impact to someone else. Nothing is impossible. Once you have that image in your brain of what you want to be in the next 50 years, all you need to do is just have a clear picture. You need to have the most clarity in your life. Have a kid like imagination because you need to make sure that you have so much faith in this that you're going to do whatever it takes to make it win. Faith without works is dead. So if you don't put in the work, you won't get any types of results. And nothing is impossible. You know, we are always putting limits on ourselves. And we never want to stay true to us. And that's why we are trying to put on a fake show. That we always want to get the easy way. And oh, I don't want to do this because it's uncomfortable for me. Well, if it's uncomfortable for you, I'm sorry to say, you have to take some sacrifices. You're going to either have to sacrifice to sleep, sometimes you're going to have to sacrifice your time, and just, you know, your stress level might be impacted because now you're putting more pressure, but that pressure is okay for you because you are seeing what you are capable of, and you have to at least see what you are capable of so that you can succeed in the next future because your future is waiting on you to be who you need to be so that you can be successful. And don't wait on any approval for nobody. Don't doubt yourself that you're not going to win. If you feel as if you're going, you're not going to win, then nine times out of ten, you're not going to win. All you have to do is just seek opportunities, either from someone that you've known that has been through what you want to go through, or someone that you can just look up to for advice. But keep chasing your greatness that is in you. You just have to have so many reasons to flourish and live a new life that you should be living. And you need to literally stay motivated throughout the whole entire process. What is your motivation? You need to be in a do or die situation so that you can always chase your dreams. You can always see the light. What matters to you the most? Do you want to succeed or do you just want to have the idea of succeeding in your mind? You have to make sure that you go for it every single day because you can do it. Like, you are not who you are, but you are because you can do whatever it takes to chase your dreams. You have to be disciplined no matter what. There are days where you're tired. There are days where you're stressed out. There are days where you just don't feel like doing it, but you have to do it anyway. You can't stop until it's done. You cannot stop until it's finished. Don't give yourself an excuse. The moment you give yourself an excuse is the moment you are quitting on yourself. Why quit on yourself? Because literally everything that you just put in from when you started till now literally just went to waste. Don't make anything go to waste. Make something of yourself. Make sure that when you are working on your dreams that you are very confident in yourself that you are going to succeed and you're doing it. Not because you are forced to do it, but you're doing it because you want to do it and you want to succeed, and you genuinely want to see success in your near future. Seeing it, and you have to believe it, because there are people that don't believe in you. That's when you have to believe in yourself the most. You have to believe in yourself like you have to be so crazy about yourself. I'm sorry, but there's no other way to put it. If you're not crazy about this, you're not going to do what it takes you're not going to see any other answers outside of your questions that you have about yourself. You're always going to be confused. You're always not going to try. So just try and do it. Get it over with. Don't put it off till tomorrow. Tomorrow might not exist anymore. You know, tomorrow you might not wake up. So just keep going for it. Have the heart, the will to change. You know, you need to make sure that you have so much faith in your life to change because... 
there's so much pressure in yourself just to seek new things. Don't doubt yourself that you're not going to win. Because if you doubt yourself, it's going to be too late. You need to literally stay motivated throughout the whole entire process. So just keep pushing. You have to be disciplined no matter what. Don't make any mistakes in the process of chasing your dreams. So always have the heart. You know, you have to make sure that you're going to do it so that you don't lie to yourself. If you're lying to yourself, it's almost like you're lying to somebody else. The most closest people to you, which is your mom and your dad. Those people that are most important, you're lying to them too. And just be brave. You have to build that braveness. You have to build that courage to get yourself in front of what you are scared about. Because once you pass by what you're scared of, multiple times you're not going to be scared anymore. It's just fear. Fear is false events appearing real. So just keep on thinking that this fear is not going to scare me to death. So you might jump. You might feel nervous. You might have so many emotions coming out of that fear, but nothing is going to happen to you. You're not going to be harmed for a long time. Just keep moving. You're always grumpy because you always have things that you want to do, but you can't do them because you're not being affirmative with yourself. You have to have authority and say that I'm going to challenge myself to succeed at whatever the cost is. You have to put blood, sweat, and tears to this every single day. And those tears, you have to just wipe them off and just keep going. Even if you're sad, you still have to go through it. You have to build emotion to this because if you don't, it's like you don't even care. So you just have to keep chasing your dreams and be gracious enough to give yourself gratitude when you don't succeed. And if you do lose, be grateful because any loss can always be recouped. You can always build on top of that loss. You can always build yourself up to who you need to be. You always can do things out the norm. You know, don't be the same. Don't be like anybody else. Be yourself. You are enough to anything. Just be what you want to be. Be original. You got this. Don't even think of anything otherwise. You can do it. You want to go the easy way? Think about this. You go the easy way now, you won't get anywhere. You go the harder way now, you'll get anywhere you want to go. It's that simple. Just build, build, and then you have a house. You need to be stable every single day. You need to think every single day. It's not easy to think sometimes and have everything mapped out. But with more practice, you got this. Don't worry about anything. You have to have a great day. Let's go stay motivated. The reason why you're not where you want to be right now is because you're not consistent every single day. And you have to make sure that every day you are going for it. And it's not what happened yesterday that says, oh, I don't want to do it today because it was too rough yesterday. No, you have to do this every single day. You have to either play to this game to win or you're playing to lose. So make sure you stay consistent every single day. And consistency is the name of the day. You have to go every day and make sure that your dream is accomplished every single day take small steps so that you can take big leaps you got this and as long as you win and you want to win you'll always win every single day you got this stay motivated and have a great night let's go